You know, Wittenberg uh, started out, you know, pretty tough, and we found our way, uh, got our feet on the ground, and, and kind of cruised in the singles. Um, and we knew Dennison was going to be, you know, they were going to throw everything they possibly had at us. Um, coach Schilling, he was my coach at Ohio State. Um, you know, he was the assistant there, so he was there for 20 years. That's a team that won, you know, probably close to 20 Big Ten titles, and. Um, you know, he knows how to win and he knows how to coach. Um, he's a mentor of mine uh, in every sense of the word. So I knew, man, this is going to be, you know, I knew exactly what was going to come at us because I know, you know, kind of the culture that was created when we were, you know, at Ohio State together. And that's what came. They, they came in the building. It was high energy. There was just a lot of competitiveness. The doubles was neck and neck, neck and neck. Um, you know, and then I think once the singles started, our guys really just settled down. And uh, it was it was one of my, you know, proudest moments of them. I mean, they this team came in and just was throwing everything at us, every bit of energy they had. And we just kind of settled down and, and, um, and played our games. And singles, you know, surprisingly just went incredibly smooth. You know, we, we've kind of been practicing now for about um, a month. You know, we've been at it since the beginning of February. And, um, you know, finally been able to start competing again. Uh, our first dual match was, you know, last weekend. Um, and it, it felt really great to get back out there because, you know, you think about it, it's been, it was basically a year since, um, you know, our season got cut short last year to where we, we were able to, you know, get back out there and start playing again. And uh, it, it just felt like really good, um, you know, a lot of high energy. Um, you know, we've, we've been trying to, you know, prepare for this, um, you know, having a lot of intensity in practice. And, um, you know, yeah, like I said, um, you know, we had, we had a really good start um, these past two weekends, but more than anything, it just felt, you know, really good to get back out there and competing again. Um, you know, there's nothing like that feeling of playing alongside your teammates and uh, playing for something more than yourself. So we're really fortunate enough to, to have that opportunity again. And uh, we're really excited to, you know, just keep doing that. Um, we have a few more matches, you know, throughout the rest of the spring. And then, um, you know, we're, we're going to see where it goes from there. Hopefully um, we'll get our shot at the NCAA tournament. So on Friday um, at noon, we're going to start our warm up against Northwestern Ohio. It'd be kind of fun. We're, we're at Mayfield Village and there's 12 indoor courts there. So the women are going to be playing on six courts and then the men are going to be playing on the other six. And that'll be pretty fun because, uh, you know, we'll all be playing together. Um, you know, there aren't many places or facilities around where you can, you know, put 12 courts out there and play the men and the women at the same time. So we're looking forward to that, um, kind of sharing that experience with them. Northwestern Ohio is an NAIA school that has done a great job recruiting. They've got very good players. Um, you know, they're on paper, you know, we played Finley so far, they played Finley, they shut out Finley. So did we. So I, you know, I think it's going to be tough when we played them last year. You know, every match was close, and um, you know, luckily we were able to, to pull that one out. But um, you know, a big focus of ours ever since the Denison match ended was okay. Let's improve. Let's get better. Um, our team has gone over our values. You know, a big, a big, big thing is just constant improvement and and, and just getting better every single day. So we're gonna be hungry to get out against UNOH and really prove that we've learned from the stats and the things that we analyzed uh, from Denison and put that into effect against UNOH. And then we'll get on a, a charter bus on um, Saturday morning. I, I joked with uh, Missy actually, this is the first time I'm getting on a charter bus in 13 years. And uh, we're taking a drive to Dayton, Ohio and I, I don't even, my ideas are just flying around, like all the things that we could talk about and do as a team, just going on a, a trip together. Um, you know, me personally, I don't think I've been on a highway in like six months. So I'm just like really, really excited to just get on a highway and go somewhere, <laughs> you know? Um, and, and, you know, we've played them once now, so what we're going to do is we're going to play everybody on Saturday. So all of our players, you know, from top to bottom on the roster are going to get a chance to compete on Saturday. Um, going to get a chance to take a trip together, a chance to bond and, and kind of 
just kind of add to our culture and add to you know our experiences together. So we're really, really excited for this weekend.